Hi everybody, this is Greg with Age Verify, and in this video I'm going to walk you through adding in our Age Verify code into an OpenCart website. So to begin with here, I have two tabs open in my browser. Uh, the first one here is my OpenCart dashboard, which you're likely familiar with. And the second tab I need to have open is ageverify.co. And we're going to access the Age Verify uh, website later on in this video to grab our age verification code so that we can copy and paste it into our OpenCart dashboard. So from the OpenCart dashboard on the left hand side here, you want to scroll down through these menu options until you get to the design menu option listed right here, design, and click on that. It opens a sub panel and from, from design you want to choose theme editor, click on the theme editor option here. And from theme editor, it opens up a new panel here on the right. And we want to make sure that our store, uh, in this demo, I just have a default one chosen. If you have more than one theme going, make sure you have the uh, theme selected that you're actually using on your website. And once you have that selected, uh, you'll want to go down here where it says choose a template and you're going to locate the one that says common and we'll click on common. And then it gives us a whole variety of files now to choose from. And we want to scroll down until we find header.twig and here it is header.twig. And I'm going to click on this and it's going to open an uh, editor here on the right hand side. So within the editor, what I want to do is I want to locate the opening head tag and I can find it right here in mine. It's on line eight. Yours might be in a slightly different place if you're using a different template, but I found my opening head tag here and it's worth noting that the opening head tag is different than the closing head tag and a closing head tag. If I scroll down here a little ways, I can find it. You can see it right here. Closing head tag has this forward slash before the word head, and that is not the tag we're looking for. You want to scroll up, and from that head tag right there, I put my cursor behind it. I'm just going to make a new line by hitting enter. And so now I've got a new line, and this is where we're going to paste our age verify script right in here on line nine. So now we're ready to get our age verify script. Let's go over to the age verify website. And from age verify, you can click on get started. And within Get Started, we have a whole variety of templates to choose from. Uh, scroll through them, uh, find one that suits your business. For the purpose of this video, we're just going to use our translucent one. I'll click on Learn More. And within the template here, you can look at demos if you so choose. And we have three tiers of service. We have a basic version here, which is ad supported, and there's no charge to use this. Uh, but you can see it does display ads in the bottom. We have a pro version here, and the pro version is very similar to basic. The main difference is that there are no advertisements. And then we have a custom version. With a custom instance, uh, we can build this uh, to your exact specifications. So your branding, your colors, uh, your exact text, additional foreign languages, geolocation, all kinds of stuff we can add into a custom instance. But for the purpose of this video, we're going to stick with our basic version here. So I'll scroll down, and I found this option here that says click for instructions. I will click on that. And we are in our installation instructions and code generator uh, page here. So select template back background. We've already chosen translucent, but if we did want to change it at this point, we could. Uh, we just open the, the menu and choose a different one, but we'll stick with translucent. Select your website platform. We're going to go to open cart. Select your method format. So there are two types of age verification prompts. There's an age button prompt, which you see here. And this is a preview over here on the right as to what that looks like. Uh, or there's a date of, birth in, date of birth input prompt. And we have it in two formats, either month, day, year, which is the typical format in the United States, or day, month, year, which is the format outside of the United States. And all the text within these prompts, both the date of birth and the age button is configurable. Uh, so if you need a foreign language, you can easily configure that here in the next step. But we're gonna stick with age button prompt. And I've got additional custom settings. And, and here it is actually, as I mentioned, you can change the prompt text. So if I want to change that instead of to say hello, you can see over here on the right in the preview that it did change the text and that's how it's going to look. But we will keep it with welcome. And this is the, the button text. If you want to change it to read something different, you could edit that as well. Underage redirect, redirect location. That's where you're going to send underage users if they click the I am underage button right here. By default, we haven't going to age verify, but you could send that to be any website you want. And once you get all these options configured how you want them, down below here, part two of two installation instructions, there's this red code right here. And all you simply want to do is highlight that with your mouse and then you can right click it and choose copy. Uh, or once you have it highlighted, if you're on a Mac, you can hit command C. If you're on a Windows computer, you can hit control C to copy that to your clipboard. 
you'll go back over to the open cart theme editor. And again, right below the head tag here on line nine, we're simply gonna paste in our code. And it pastes it on a single line here. It goes quite a ways to the right. You can see that all in there and that's fine. It can all be listed there. Uh, just so long as it pastes in, you see it opens here with a script tag. And once we get that pasted in, we'll just go ahead and click save. And that's it. We've added Age Verify into our OpenCart website. We can take a quick look as to how that looks uh, up here in the top menu on the right hand corner. You can click on your store. It'll open a new tab. And here it is. Here's my demo store. And here is the Age Verify overlay on top of it. And if I click it, it goes away and I can scroll through the website. Thanks for watching the video. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to email us. We'd love to hear from you. We try to respond to all emails within 24 hours. Thanks.